Hi, I'm Inga Valentina. I'm Sam Prince. And we are doing the relationship quiz with OK. Who made the first move? Think was it you? <laughs> it was when we first met, is that right? Well, yeah, you made the first move within five minutes of meeting me. It was ten minutes, no, I see. <laughs> <laughs> and when I said I said kiss me? No, I feel like you were giving me, you were like eye signaling me the entire night. We actually met at Liv Bentley's birthday and then we were sat quite far away from each other but you just kept sort of staring. This was just me, yeah. yeah, yeah it was I, just you. Yeah, I kept staring. <laughs> and then I came over to you and I said, kiss me. And then you lunged at me. And that was it. Yeah. True romance. I don't agree with that account of your story, no. Who's the funniest? Incorrect. <laughs> I think I'm the funniest. I make you laugh all the time. You make me laugh like once in a while. I make you laugh a lot. Do you know what? Actually, I think something switched. I think at the beginning of the relationship, you were funnier. And then it sort of switched over to me and I started... I admit to... that recently you've been a lot funnier than you used to be, for sure. <laughs> or I'm just a cheap laugh, one or the other. I'm a cheap laugh, so... Yeah. Who takes the longest to get ready? I'm gonna have to see you again. Yeah, definitely. It's that Barnet. It it's, just takes so long. Sometimes new... you disappear into the bathroom and I don't know what you're doing. These girls don't understand it's like a good head day and it's a bad head day. Well, I understand and that. Sometimes you have to tackle this bad hair day head on, and recently I've had a lot of bad hair days. I must say, oh. going blonde, it's a nightmare for me. I like what are you doing in the bathroom for like two hours? The bathroom is like my sanctuary, where I just feel like calm. I put my podcast on, shave, you know, have a nice little sub routine in there. I think you go in there just to go on your phone, to be honest. And do what? <laughs> <laughs> so you get that point. Ding. Who has the most soppiest nickname? It has to be you. You have lots of nicknames. Depends. No, what? As in, you have the nicknames for me. Yeah. Yeah. And Poly they are atrocious. I do not want no, to share them. Nice with... ones, Polly, because you might be girl from Long Kim. Polly, like pretty yeah. scatty, but pretty, you know, <laughs> pretty bang on. Uh, tiny. Tiny. Stinky. Tin <laughs> Tinker. Tinker, yeah. Tinker's my favourite, Tinker's actually. Cute. The best one, my favourite. No, no, one no, is, no, um, no, 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 she's not fit. She likes being called the Princess Baby. No, 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 I don't like being called it. Yeah. You just call me yeah, that. The Princess Baby. And it makes me. You say, hey, call me Luke. Every time. I think it's cute. I think it's cute. What do you call oh, me? Yeah. What's what your nickname? You call me? Yeah, Grumpy. No, you call me a few things. Baby. Baby, yeah. I, I don't mind baby. Baby and Princess Baby. So who gets the point? Because you have the worst nicknames, but they're for me. Does that mean I get the point? So who's the most romantic? I'm gonna say you. You're definitely more romantic than I am. Yeah, I'm trying to think of what you've done that's romantic, to be honest. Um, I feel like I do small things that show I care, but you're more into like the bigger grand gestures. Yeah, I like buying you flowers when you least expect it. Yeah, you're yeah. good. You're good at buying the flowers. Please smell the dog cats. Mm. Not really, but. <laughs> okay, so round two. What is the most romantic being? Mm. Okay, I think the time that you invited me around to the flat and it was filled with rose petals and candles, that was very romantic. I thought you were going to propose and it was about a month into dating. Yeah, yeah nice and tense. <laughs> Is that yeah, the right one? Yeah, that's I the think that's pretty one? up there, yeah. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. So, I get the point. You get the point, well done. Okay, so next question. What is my proudest achievement? Getting your eye into a gallery. Oh yeah, that's a good one. I wasn't actually thinking about that though. What, what was yours? Um, when I rescued my dog. Too and I brought her over to the UK. That is her adorable. I'm proud. Yeah, that's super cute. So, you don't get a point. No. <laughs> what is the thing that I cannot live without? Me? You're up there. Okay, no, no I think it's your, your lucky hat. Yeah. Which looks like a very tiny fisherman's hat. I found this hat. And every since every day I wear this hat, the supermarket, whatever I do, this hat's firm in my head. And since that hat, I've got good luck. I've got my girlfriend back. Why don't you show everyone what your hat looks like? Look at that. This is that. It is a little bit too small, but I think it's actually child's, but I just I just love it. You look about five. Yeah. I just feel safe when it's on. It's like my safe haven. And uh, yeah. 
so I'll have to put up with. Let's get rid of it. Is there another point for me? I think I'm winning. Okay, next question. Um, what is my favourite memory of us? I know what it is. We went on this date and we basically ran across London the whole day and it was just the cutest day I'll never. It was honestly unforgettable. It's so cringy to say it was. Do you know what? That wasn't actually a memory in my head, but I will change my answer to that because that was one of my favourite days in life. It was I just, loved we that We ran day. just from bar to restaurant to bar and we just like, we were a little bit hammered and it was just, for me. It was so much fun. We ran into an art gallery, we took loads of photos. It was like a nice summer's night. That was my favourite memory. Yeah. So I'm going to give you that point. You get that point. Yes. <laughs> what do I think your best feature is? My freckles. Yeah, adorable. That's so adorable. Is that right? Am I yeah. right? When, when she's in the sun for like a little, a little bit of time, she has these like adorable freckles. And like they're almost there all year round, and I think it's adorable. Yeah. So I was There's right. lots of things I like about it, yeah. Not that much. <laughs> what were my first impressions of you when we first met? I think you said I walked into the room and I was quite confident. Mm -hmm. Is that right? I don't know. I'll tell you my answer at the end. And I think you thought I was a bit Yeah. Is that right? You name? nailed it. Cool. <laughs> a nice a nice one. Though. No, that I think, yeah. Yes, that's cute. Yeah. You get and that and what do you think of me now? The exact same. <laughs> what is my favourite movie? Okay, you told me your favourite movie when we first met and it's either The Notebook or Tattoos. Notting Hill. Mm -hmm. And I feel like you said those movies because you feel like that's how you get girls. You feel like that's what girls want to hear. Those are two of my favourite movies. Probably The Notebook. The Notebook's your favourite movie. I, say I refuse to I believe it. I lived with my nana for like a year and me and nana watched The Notebook every single night. Oh, you made it quite sweet now. Yeah, I, I do. I, Notebook's one of my favourites, for sure. Okay, so that's correct. What is my favourite holiday destination? Uh, Bali. Bali happens to be part of Inga's personality. N incorrect. What is your favourite? Um, currently New York. Do you not get that point? <laughs> I think I'm firmly in the winning <laughs> So I've won yet again. Which means you forfeit. Proud of you. And I think the forfeit should be this goes in the bin. Uh -uh. That's part of my... That's it's the forfeit. Part of me. I love it's the part forfeit. No. You can't forfeit the forfeit. Love it, it's my safe haven. Do you fancy me in this hair? No. <laughs> okay, I'll think of a different forfeit for you later then. Okay. Thank you for watching our OK Relationship Quiz. And check out our story on OK Online. <laughs>